Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Marquita, and on this video, we'll be doing a plan with me and my Erin Condren planner. You know that Fridays, I am starting to do Erin Condren videos. I know I was supposed to do Faith Friday, but I moved that to Saturday because that's been hit or miss, y'all. So I definitely want to keep um, consistency with my Erin Condren planner. So I decided to incorporate those types of videos on Friday. So if you're new here to my channel, I hope you'll stick around and continue watching and also consider subscribing and giving me a thumbs up on this video if you enjoy it. So let's jump right in and plan for the week. If you want to see that, make sure to stay tuned. using this Erin Condren planner. This was last week's spread. Super functional. As you can see, I wrote in all of my plans. Everything just worked out so well. So we're going to be doing the next week, which you guys know I don't date it. So I just flipped the page because it doesn't really mean anything that those dates are, aren't lined up. And so let's see, because typically I would be here and I think that's what I'm going to do. Although I'm not in September, I do want to kind of keep the dates lined up, although I don't really uh, look at the dates. So I want to stay within that particular week. So it's the week of the 26th through the 1st. So I decided I'm going to be using color coordinated um, or color coordinating. Um, this makes planning super easy. I'm going to go with this first initial color scheme here, which is very soft. And you guys know I love pastel colors. And I think I'm going to either go with this or this, maybe this. We'll see. Um, but I've got options here. So that's what we're doing today. So I'm going to go ahead and get started. You guys know the first thing that I do is I cover up the top part here, which I use for sections. Um, these are the sections that I typically go with. So I'm going to be flipping back and forth just to make sure I'm on track with how I, I plan until I get this like ingrained in my head. And so YouTube, my shops, I have two shops, social media, ideas and blog, business development and brands. So I'm, I was thinking I was going to change one of these sections but I don't remember which section it is. Um, I think I was maybe going to make this ideas instead of blog, but I do like having blog. And maybe I was going to move this blog to and replace brands because I don't really work too much with that many different brands. So I don't have that much to do and that can kind of fall under business development. So I might do that. So let me see what I can use to cover up these sections. I might have to go into my colorful boxes, which is fine. So so let's do gold because I think I'm going to do this spread and this has lots of gold elements in it. So let's, let's do gold. You know what I might do also? Let me see. Cause I have these from Michaels that I got a while ago and these are really cute and they have sparklies. So maybe I'll do these instead. Maybe it'll fit like perfectly in the spot. Yeah, isn't that so pretty? And I think I should have enough. So let's see, maybe I won't use this one. Maybe I'll use the circular one. So pretty, right? I mean, it has, it's like real glittery. And I love glitter. All right, there we go. So now I want to grab the dates and holidays so that way I could put the dates in there. Or maybe I'll do journaling and I'll use the dates from there. Oh, wait, I don't need dates. <laughs> what am I doing, y'all? I'm going crazy. 
Okay, subjects. So YouTube is first. So we've got all the subjects in, so now we're just gonna start decorating. That's the fun part. And I need to cover that up as well because that does not go with the color scheme. Okay, so I decided on, see I could go either way because they both have they both have um, gold in them. So I think I'm gonna do. What I also do is I cover up these hours. This is an hourly planner, but I don't use it by the hour. I use it like just a big old checklist. All right, so let's go at it, y'all. I'm gonna add this box here, which you guys know I just love to cut them and spread them throughout so that way the spread is cohesive. Okay, so now we're just gonna start adding different elements. And I might even dip into some other sticker books. If I don't find everything that I need in here to make it look really cute and decorative. Cause there's not that many decorative elements in this one. It's more so just boxes and things. I love this sticker that says, give yourself a pep talk. I need that all the time. Okay, this first section over here is where I put in all of my YouTube videos. So I'm just gonna put a checklist here. And each heart is gonna represent a day. Okay, now I need to start getting some of these gold elements in here. So y'all see how perfect these Happy Planner stickers fit in Erin Condren. So if you have switched to Erin Condren and you have a whole bunch of Happy Planner stickers, as you can see, they still fit, which is great. I love this watery color sort of pattern, so I'm gonna stick this down here, and I'm definitely going to pull some colorful boxes because I, I feel the need to. And then I want to make everything cohesive, so I'm gonna pop this one over here. All right, I need some more decorative something. Oh, well, you know what? I'm not gonna do that, because you know what? I wanna keep it simple. And if I keep on adding different things, then I'm not going to be able to have any space to write. So, I definitely wanna have space to write. 
So I think I'm just gonna stay in this sticker book. Last one, I definitely wanted to use the sticker that says Dream Big. I just gotta figure out where to put it. Because I don't have much space left. I think I'll put it right here. All right, y'all, so that is it for this plan with me and my Erin Condren planner. Again, this is my business planner, so I use it for all things business, from my shops to my YouTube channel to my social media. This is what this planner is intended for, and it has been working out quite well, so I'm gonna keep it in rotation. So again, I think Fridays is gonna be Erin Condren Fridays because I feel like Saturday video in general is hit or miss for me, and I don't want to neglect using this Erin Condren planner or showing you guys different and creative ways that I find um, helpful to use it. So I decided to try to do this on Friday instead of Saturday. So hopefully that um, helps. So that's it for this video, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed it. You got a little inspiration out of it and you found maybe something you want to use in your planner, which means you'll give me a thumbs up on this video and also consider subscribing to my channel. So thanks again for stopping by. Hopefully you enjoyed this video so much so that you will stop back by to catch another video, in which case I'll see you then.